Hello everybody and welcome to another Tech Minute video. My name is Tom from Six Foot Networks. Thank you for joining me today in my car. I wanted to briefly uh, touch on a subject that's been kind of weighing down on me for the last, uh, oh I don't know, 10 years or so. I I've been neglecting it and this is totally a personal thing, uh, so if you're not interested, um, you know, I'm sorry. <laughs> but I decided to formally take on the challenge of becoming um, a Cisco certified internetwork expert, um, or CCIE as it's called. And the reason for that is because for the last 22 years or so, I've been doing this job day in, day out, every day, sometimes weekends, holidays, and whatnot. And I haven't actively pursued a professional credential in a long time, like a certification from a reputable manufacturer such as Cisco or Apple or, you know, any of the other vendors that I primarily work in. That said, um, that changes uh, pretty much this week. I already got the books uh, for both uh, tests. I, I know Cisco changed the test uh, during COVID. They, they made the updates and they released a whole new testing format. Um, and the roadmap to get to what you, the roadmap that you need to take to get to where you need to go, if that makes sense. So this will probably take I don't know probably a good year, year and a half, and I expect uh, the first part to be complete uh, February March of 2022, and then probably eight or nine months after that will be the second part. So probably a year to a year and a half, depending on if life throws me any curveballs between now and then. That said, I feel like I, I, you know, I don't need to justify my need for professional credentials, but I feel the need to point out that, you know, they help. They help in a career, um, especially if you're a network engineer and you're trying to, you know, to build up your your reputability and your, you know, your service delivery credentials, essentially. It just makes sense to have something that you can say, well, I'm certified or I'm qualified to talk about this because I'm certified. So, you know, if you've been doing a job for X amount of years and you feel like, you know, you're kind of stagnant in what you're doing, you know, maybe look for a professional cert, you know, get get out and see if you can train up on something. And even if it's something that you've never done before, maybe it'll, you know, change the way you do things in your job. Or if you're not in IT, you can consider, you know, getting some basics. You know, A-plus uh, cert is a great place to start if you're into hardware. And even if you're not in IT, you know, you never know. But anyway... I, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. If you really like this video, then please consider subscribing to the channel as it really does help for me to create more content like this for you each and every day. In the meantime, good luck with everything and thank you for watching.